Hi guys, I'm back to the game. We're playing today. We're playing a game that I really been looking forward to because I got this for my birthday and I've been looking forward to this forever because this looks like an actual Switch Pokemon game. Honestly, from the trailer, it looks a lot better than regular Pokemon game. Looks pretty good. We're gonna see what happens. I've actually played a few seconds of it because I didn't realize all this cool stuff was happening in the beginning before I started playing. But we already talked to Arceus, which is weird, and they turned my phone into an Arceus phone. I think is what it's called. And like you're in the future and you went back in the past. I'm not even sure what happened, but Arceus is like there and he's talking to you and it's cool. But now we're gonna get into this. So let's, oh, do you wake up? Don't you? Okay. Wait, what? I'm being surrounded by. Are you alive, my boy? Uh, what is going on here? Uh, what is going on? Why am I? What? Did I get sent back in time or another dimension? What just happened? This is cool for a Pokemon game. Wow, why is he so bright? Whoa, why am I so bright? You gave me quite the shock falling from the sky like that. But thank goodness you seem unarmed. Who are you? Where am I? Whoa. Why, this is Pus Prelude Beach, of course. Dear me, did you shock into fall somehow at all your memory? My friend, the feature. I mean, it's unusual. You wouldn't have to have an acquaintance in these parts, would you? I don't know. I see, you seem to be in a bit of a pickle. Might I offer some directions. Do you have somewhere around here you could stay? No, nowhere. Why is there no voice acting? <laughs> so you don't know anyone here and you don't even know where you where to spend the night. Well, this is proper pickle deed. Are you quite sure you're able to survive? Somehow, I guess. Why is there a portal above the mountain? Let's see, well, no gentleman would abandon a person in such need. Crew! Boom! Push splash! Oh my, I completely forgot that I just caught up these caught up to these three runaway Pokemon when you tumbled out of the sky. It's almost as if they knew you'd appear. Ah, oh, but do you even know what Pokemon is? Of course I do. Ah, oh, that's really the you fell from the sky seems we have more than some common ground. Yes, well these three Pokemon belong to me, mysterious creatures that they are. Oh yes, and what might your name be? Already said, yeah. Oh, you're called Crowcheck. Your name was quite the ring to imagine. I must have been seen. Oh, but I do apologize. I haven't even introduced myself. My name is Lavington. I'm something of a program professor. That is to say, I'm that is to say, I'm a scholar seeking to deepen our understanding of Pokemon. Okay, so professor, these are three here. We and they're running away again. Oh, blast and baller, my daring darling Pokemon. Why much you run away from me? Wow, that was bad, right? I'm terribly sorry, but do you think you could help me round them up? I beg you. Wait, you three, wait. Okay. This is a brand new, whoa. 360 degree camera Pokemon game? Yes, thank you. What's that out there? Can I, I can crouch? Holy crap. Dash, it's dash. Oh, I can. Run? Okay. Well, he runs super quick. Well, look at this. Oh my gosh. They Now this already feels like a better game than Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield. Yes, this is my super advanced phone that I got from a Pokemon because give it to me. Oh my gosh. Okay. Why? What? He has to wait to look at it? Oh my gosh. You found something that resembles a phone. It's probably your phone, but it's changed shape. You feel a strange power emanating from it. A message appeared on the screen. I bestow upon thee this arc phone and thy mission seek out all Pokemon. Whoa. Okay. What? Is he not gonna give this this, this thing to anyone else in the game? He's like, nope, this is mine and only mine. You guys don't get no phones. You guys gotta live in the back ages. What is going on here? Well, so far this game looks pretty decent. The texture could be a little better, but I mean, I'm just nitpicking here. Alas, yet another miss. My new friend from the sky. I tried catching my little runaways by tossing footballs in their way, but I'm not the best this door thing, you see. I'd love to give you a go at it, but perhaps I should tell you a bit about these three first. Now oh, that one is Rowlet. Yep, that's the one I'm gonna choose. Rowlet can play since I was like a play and apparently it battles using his trip feathers. True. Cool. Uh, that one over there is Cyndaquil. The fire burning on Cyndaquil back will flare up whenever it's surprised by or irritated. Foom. 
that one's Oshawott. Your opponent is Oshawott. Oshawott can knock off flying in water and it can battle using shell shaped like object on the belly. Push flash, I'm taking the. <laughs> Oh, um, go on, my. I need to forget the most the, the, the crucial thing how to go about catching Pokemon. Here you go, my boy. My. Here you go. Here you are, my boy. Pokeballs. Throw these at Pokemon to catch them. 50? Holy crap. The mysterious ball that can be thrown at wild Pokemon in order to catch them. These balls are crafted by hand together with necessary material. Can I not scroll down? Oh, uh, but you. But that won't be due for a bunch of I do apologize, let me be more thorough. Now, I mentioned already that Pokemon are strange, marvelous creatures. What's so strange about them, you ask? Well, each and every Pokemon is able to shrink down itself down to a minuscule size, and that's where Pokeballs come in. Pokeballs are a rich invention, you see. They're all one of them at Pokemon, and why the Pokemon shrink down and fit inside the ball, comfy as can be, and with that, you caught a Pokemon. I know you just meant, but I'm afraid I have no else to turn to. Be awful grateful if you could catch my three runaways. <coughs> now the proper technique is to take aim at the Pokemon and let the ball fly. It's quite simple. Though be though far from be it from ugh, though far be it from me to say so, I suppose, given my own dire lack of skill in this area. Wow. Pokemon can be cut by throwing Pokemon though. Hold down the ZR button to ready a Pokeball and then aim. Keep moving around as you do to the right stick to adjust your angle and being careful of your target. Okay. You release the ZR button to if it hits a Pokemon, then you may be able to catch it. If you're ready to Pokeball, do not want to throw it, press the B button to cancel. Okay. So like this. And then B. Okay. Oh, no. That's right. Give me the Pokeball. I gotta pick it up. Oh wow, I gotta wait for okay. Draw a useful skill you have around here. Only two of my darling runaways left now. Still, this is no shame. You don't seem favorable to Pokemon in the slightest. Uh, no sh- mm, crap. What am I doing? I know- Oh. Let's go. Let's splash. I'm taking a bath. Now, where the heck is- I can hardly believe it. Incredible. No many people fear to even approach Bubble. Never mind catch them. Bubble, indeed. Let's wrap this up. Sharpie, sh where the heck is, is, uh, what's his face? How did I lose him? Is he way up here? Oh, the render distance is really bad. Oh, don't beat that sound. Wow, that's a pretty far render distance, actually. Push splash, I'm taking it back. Oh, wow, really? Oh, yes, I'm afraid I can have a book laws are hardly 100% proof of giving another go, my old boy. Where'd he go? Didn't even know I caught you, did you? Is it a catch this time? No. Well, this is already a much better game than Brilliant Tournament Dino Pro and Locket or X and bleh, Sword and Shield. Oh, what a relief to have them all back. You see, the three Pokemon you caught have only just arrived to the village to help with our riches. They won't yet listen to anyone. And as mentioned, they bolted from the village almost as if they knew you called them falling down. But I must say, I take it back by how well you use Pokeballs. Is it, how is it that you catch Pokemon so ably when you just only arrived here? One kid would think there's a reason you appear here now. Seek out all Pokemon. The object is an arc phone, you say. What, could, what an odd device could be guiding you somehow? If you know your former, there's something I'd like to share with you. You see, I have a dream to complete the, compile this region's first complete record of its Pokemon. We need to call such a catalog a Pokedex. It's a proper Pokedex is wonderful work of research containing detail records of all the Pokemon to be found in the region. But in order to properly document Pokemon, one must of course catch them. And therein lies the rub, I'm afraid. Pokeballs have only just been many, and not many have mastered the skill of using them. And to you, a person with clear talent for catching Pokemon. Your goal is to seek out every Pokemon and mine said this Pokemon caught. Situation right for teamwork, don't you agree? Tell me now, what do you say? Shall we help one another out, my boy? Yes. Then whoever and from wherever you may be, I welcome you with open and we'll leave a Pokedex to complete. First thing first, let's get back. Let's get these Pokemon back to the village. Then we'll sort out 
your lodging and find you some proper clothes and a mill and all that. Follow me then onward to Jubilife City. Jubilife? Jubilife Village. Whoa, what's going on now? What the heck? Yeah, I was wondering what that thing was in the background. It's a rip in space and time. Right? Ooh, ominous. Thank you for your charge for keeping us safe, my good guardsman. This young man was of great assistance to me in my Pokemon, so I hope you'll forget my bringing him into the village for a bit. They didn't even say anything. They didn't nod. They really need voice acting in this game. This would take you to the next level. Nice. Yep, this game looks a lot better than Sword and Shield did. Ooh, they actually look like they played an effort for this one. Man, I can't believe Pokemon actually made it again. It looks this good. This way, if you please. It's come a long way thanks to the fine people of the Galaxy Expedition Team. The first real world is known as locals as Canal Avenue. Where'd you come from? What? Those your books got you two years ago. There's much to do and not many to do it. And as we know so little, a local book a lot of people has to set foot outside the village. And then the present building of us is Galaxy Hall headquarters for his entire outfit. Wow. Hmm. Oh, bother, bother, what? I'd almost forgotten. I need to go and report what, that we successfully recovered to escape Pokemon. I'm going to ask you to wait for me in the canteen. Just past this bridge here and then to the left, the wallflower, it's called. Yes, let's go. This feels like an actual game now. Look at this. Somehow it seems to show where you need to go next. Use the, whoa, whoa, wait, wait. Use the button to view the map on your phone. You can consult the map for guidance for your next decision and information on the mission's request. You will also see guide markers when you're out exploring or running around the village. Okay. Wow. If you're not sure where to go next, stop and look around in all directions and try to spot one of these markers. Okay. This feels like an actual game, man. They actually put effort in this. This feels like a legit game. Look at this. We Can I go in? This feels like a legit game, man. This, why does he have green hair? A green mustache. Oh no, aren't you awfully suspicious? The wall falls for Galaxy Team Football and we don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Is this our rival? For you, I've never seen anyone dressed like you are. If whatever you're attacked by a Pokemon, you'd be mince meat in those flimsy clothes. Whoa. If the guard let you three, you must have ties with somebody in the village. He's a scholar from a faraway place. His Pokemon do get away from him at times, but it makes me a bit worried for him. Someone hardly wanted to talk. I've had some trouble with Pokemon myself. I was hit by a Pokemon move called Thunder, shocked not so long ago, and had to take to my bed. But to Professor Wild, I do wonder how long he'll last. Wow. I'm afraid just like Akari says, I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. <laughs> Professor! But everything will be quite alright now. Has agreed to help us with our Pokedex. Pulling a point into the Survey Corps? You can't just slap a badge on whoever you like without Captain Cillian. I'll allow it. Cillian? Captain Cillian. Assuming the individual contributor to the Survey Corps, that is. I'm the Captain Galaxy Intervary Corp, you may call me Cillian. Sicilian? Sicilian? Silen? <clears throat> the Professor Leventon has told me how he helped me secure his Pokemon when I slipped his control and how it seems he would like us to feed and house and you in exchange for your ongoing labor. Hmm, you look to be 15 or so. Wow, quite old enough to work for your keep. We keep simply take on a stranger who wanders in among us without any idea of their skills or origins. Tomorrow we'll see if you can prove yourself worthy. Oh, a most reasonable decision, Captain. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you've got plenty of questions for our visitor. It's quite all right. I prefer to you alone. Might appreciate my meals without destruction.
Loof as always, I see. One of my verses can share a meal and some pleasant commission, then, eh? Benny, old chum, the usual potato mochi, if you please. Make it for three today. Wonderful fuss. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Your potato mochi never failed to please. Professor, where exactly did you meet our visitor here? Oh, well, you know of the great hole in the sky that one people call the space time rift? I need friend from right out of it. You can't be serious. Come now, I am a scientist. My job is to observe and explain all, but any and all phenomena, I can turn myself only with the facts. Now you already know where there are many Pokemon here in the Sui region, that there are in, that there are in grass and forth of water or wherever they like. Our job is to further research and find out what kind of creatures they are. Well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. Wow. So much wasn't know what kinds of powerful they may possess or what sort of wondrous things they can do. That's where Kroshek will come in. He successfully caught three Pokemon, three of them in a quick order, you understand. Nobody that got to capable of feats such as that. He's going to get fun to begin our Pokemon research in earnest. Three, we have hard enough time catching even one when wild Pokemon come after us. Well, well, to be very fair to Pokemon that puts you weren't on the attack, but a key to catching Pokemon is getting close enough to aim your Pokemon as well as it seems. Our new friend here is really to do just that. Does Sir Pokemon really have the leeway to be enjoying a leisure meal with with the outsider? You're catching just over 10 whole portions of potato mochi, you know. This, the slow progress on the Pokedex here clearly has her on edge. I'm sure we'll start to rain in the good captain's stress eating soon enough. Now, have you have your fill, Coach, and I think if you make an exact scene, you'll never have to worry about a meal again. The team provides for all the members' needs and they said members fell out of the sky. Wow. Yep, this is definitely a whole different kind of Pokemon game. This looks Way better than Sword and Shield. Way, way better. Quite delicious indeed. <laughs> yes, the food was lovely, but more importantly, it has trial to pass to Jeremy, don't you? Not to worry, I have complete confidence in Crochex for skills. Let's hope it's not misplaced, was it? For tonight, at least, we'll provide you with a place to sleep. We may use our quarters there. Well, you found the pastor, I'll put you out, put you, put to you tomorrow, you, what? If, but if you fail to pass the trial, I'll put you, to you tomorrow, you must move on. We expect for the place to meet your fate and perhaps your death in the wilds. Wow, they actually have death in a Pokemon game? Holy crap. Yep, this is a different kind of ball game. Captain Silent, somewhat like Yasui and that, they're both quite harsh. Now, now, the simple, she, she simply puts on a stern front to help keep us all safe. Anyway, I think it's time we turned in for the night. It's a good thing one can't follow the futons we sleep in here. I imagine our new friend has had enough fun for one day. And with that, I bid you both a good night. Yes, good night. A rift in the sky. People flying from it. The world is full of surprises. Full of surprises, they say. Nice. This is cool. This is probably the best Pokemon game I've played in a long time because this feel, feels like it's actually a Switch game. Mm. I cannot wait to play this. I'm actually playing now, but you know, I actually get out to explore and do everything I'm supposed to do, which is cool. Wait, what is this? A nice find of sun near Earth can help keep the entire room eat it. Okay. Nice. So now what? Survey tips contain all sorts of information to help you carry it. Read them anytime, simply press the up button to open the menu and go to your help screen. Okay. Or a tip for team handy tip for team members. Don't wish your tools to be forgotten. Delegate record keeping will save you from such a fate. To save your progress, open to press the up button to open the menu. Scroll with ZL and ZR button until you reach the save screen. There's also an all save function you can have for your progress. Oh my god. You can enable or disable all save by scrolling to help screen the menu. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. Is that it? Oh, okay, cool. Can I rest now? Rest. Rest until tomorrow, yes. This is cool. This is way better than... 
for this. Could be real and poop. Could be. What was that? Was that? Was that the new Pokemon? Uh, I can't remember what it's called. The next day. Are you up quite some lightning last night, wasn't it? Today's the day of your trial, sir. Let's give it our all. Go to the Galaxy Team Headquarters. Wait, I can investigate this? Could you store lots and lots of items in it? Okay, cool. Cool, cool, okay. So we're gonna be storing a lot of items, I guess? What little lover we got. I hope you had a nice sleep if it is the land is strange to do to you. Let's get to headquarters. Captain Silene is waiting. Let's go. This is awesome. This feels like a real game. Wait, what? I wonder what a dolly would look like. Okay, whatever. We'll come back to that later. Enter. Well, the survey corp officers are here on the first floor. Don't give up. Keep those eyes open. They they were everywhere, attacking from all sides. I sent out my partner Pokemon play against a whole pack of out out This is what happens when you go so go so far. Out out filled with the metal corpse will put you. Put you to rights. What? And even with his own partner, he took a beating from wild Pokemon. Without a partner Pokemon of your own, you might find his trial particularly trying. Captain Silene Crosscheck is here. You may enter. Why does it seem like everything's washed out? It's very bright. Let's get straight to it. If you wish to join a game, prove yourself capable by going out into the obsidian firelands, catching three Pokemon. Bidoof, Starly, and Chinx. Catching three Pokemon from the start. No one in the guys team has ever managed that. This stranger did not catch three different Pokemon only yesterday. My trial should be simple enough for him if the perfect one to add anything that is. The guys team does not have the means to provide for those who only take without getting. If you wish to stay, you must prove beyond any doubt that you will be assisted or thing. Nice. Only one of our story course statues to carry whatever you may need in the field. I got a bag. Nice. The statue doesn't exactly match your uh, mode of dress. Carry, I expect you to step in if anything goes worry. Nice. Activate guide. Press the Y button to come to map in your arc film. You can check the statue you're waiting. You have waiting, there are two type missions two type missions in the request. Mission must be completed before I guess eventually while well, requests are optionally given by people you meet. Okay. Come with me a moment. Okay. This is where I get my story book on up. Let's go. Now then, a jolly good morning to everyone. Is there some is something the matter, Professor Laventon? In order to compete your Pokedex and while simply surviving as unforgetting land, you absolutely must pass this trial. And as a professor program, I just got the ticket to overcome with that. Let's go! Boom! Push splash! Go on, pick the Pokemon that strikes your fancy. You will be able to fight off wall Pokemon outside the village. These little darlings are very dear to me, but it's plain to see they are rather curious about you. Well, wait, which Pokemon do you like to keep as your very own? Going for Oshawott. Or no, uh... This guy, I love this Pokemon. Rollet. Yes. Rollet it is, my boy. Oh yeah, this game looks awesome. And with that, one of the Pokemon you caught at, at Purdue Beach for me will now be yours to keep good and good show. I've tucked Rollet back inside the Pokeball so you to take it, it's yours. Did they actually hand me it? Nice. You received a relic. Let's go. Nice. A word of advice, my boy. Pay close attention to which puzzles are empty and which ones 
Stay by when you're out in the field. Mm. They look as if they're cheering on their friend Rollins. But perhaps they're jealous that you get to help with your trial. That could well be. They did go dashing from the village when Kurt fell out of the sky, after all. Well, not to worry, you two. I'll have, I'll have you assist me with my research for now. Boom. Flash. By the by, what species has Captain Sutton charged you with catching? Oh, that's smashing. All three of the species can be found in the obsidian field land. Let me give you some pokeballs to use during your trial, then. Didn't I just have 50? Those pokeballs may be a handcuffed, but they work to treat it as if, as you've already seen. But this trial cleared in no time. I guess you're finally ready. You don't have to leave us your trial turn left after you exit headquarters and head to the gate. I mean, no doubt. Let's go! Game's very dialogue heavy so far, but uh, yeah. All right, guys, so let's get to the end of the city here and see what happens. Oh, wow, I can actually switch. Okay, cool. Wait, can I actually throw a rallet out here? I can. Awesome. Oh, wow. That is awesome. Oh, wow, I can't send it back in this. Okay, that's cool. What manner address is that? I wish I. Wait, what? You should spend some time talking to everyone. Is that fashion where you come from? Of course it is. I'd rather, from my experience, a lot of Pokemon tech me now. I'm scared to even foot outside the village. Why are they such afraid? Okay. Whatever. I don't change my clothes. Oh, that one's bad, Puffin. A little bit bad, but not too bad. It's fine. Grass always pops in pretty badly. Let's go! Wait, what? This way? Wait. Oh, okay, so I gotta walk all the way around the village, I guess? Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Let's just run this way, I guess. Can I pick these up? I guess not. Not yet. I don't want to go that way. Did I go the wrong way? Might have went the wrong way. Or maybe I go this way? I'm not sure. No, I don't think I can go anywhere else. I think I go the wrong way. How do I... How do I bring up the map? No, map. Map. Where's the map? There we go. Okay, so how do I... Where am I supposed to go? This doesn't... Okay, you've been sent... Deport on the Obsidian field land from Jubilee's front gate. Okay. Is this the front gate? It has to be the front gate, right? Or maybe they want their own way. Right? This has to be the front gate, right? 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 There's no way. Is there another gate over here? Guess they want their own way? Oh well. Yeah, I guess they want their own way. Makes sense. Now I don't understand why I did it wrong. So there's two gates. So, okay. That's cool. Okay. Nice. Who is this guy? Is he the champion? <laughs> there's no champions yet. Oh, what a curious step you have there. I can already tell you're quite the character. I'm Volo of the Kinko Guild. The go-to choice for any of your mercantile needs here in Isui. I've heard talk about you fell from the sky, didn't you? Now that's certainly a tell I like to hear. Oh, and you're you're a Pokemon. Oh, and you've a Pokemon. You're certainly full of your surprises. Investigating the odd and novel is key to any good merchant success. So what do you say? How about you and I see how our Pokemon stand to one another in a battle? Like the I uh, like you better, better. We'll do the like we'll find. I've also heard about this trial, your two come attempt. Let's have a quick battle to see if your blood pump before you head out. They'll help you know you lose your Pokemon HP reaches zero. No duh. 
Wait, is this it? Okay. Nice. This is cool. Pokepeep? Okay. Let's go! Okay, how do I fight a Gus? I know Gus. Okay. Let's dust it again. Damn. Let's dust it again. Nice. Now this feels like a real quick one battle. Battle of the Sun. Use them on and we'll open up to you. Level up? New move, what I learned. It's always good, fun to have Pokemon do battle, don't you think? And as they gain experience to battle, they'll learn more moves and grow even stronger. Sometimes, Pokemon sometimes learn their moves when they level up. If you want to change the moves your Pokemon use in battle, then open your section and choose a Pokemon you want to select to change move option. Well, here have your own Pokemon and boy more knew how to use Pokeballs. Anyway, let me help you, let me help our two battles Battler recover from your little exercise. Nice. And to you, my five skull my skyfall in front of present some potions and things. Do you have potions? Topical potions you really need. Okay. You can use them report whenever they might be worn out from battle. I'll be hoping I'll be hoping that you're successful on that trial of yours. More galaxy members are means more customers for yours truly after all. Let's go. Can we go now? That's really something. Not only can you catch Pokemon, you can lead them in battle. Now on to now to the city and field lands. Feel like make sure you choose a destination from your map and tell Reese the garden where you're going. That way someone can come to aid you if you're knocked out by a Pokemon. Your trial begins just a short way past that front gate. Nice. So do I actually talk to him? You're correct, correct. I was informed you'd be passing through. Your trial will take place outside the safety of the village. Please take care and come back alive. Is this what is it? No, wait, what? You wish to go to the field lanes camp? Why not? Can I go to the stadium field now? And just run around? Oh, there's a camp? Okay, then know there's a camp. This is our base camp, the last safe haven before you reach the walls. For your trial, you must catch three species Bidoof, Starling, and Shinx. Okay, are you ready to get started? Yep, let's go. Oh, Professor, something wrong. Oh, well, you see, Captain Gull Hill holding me after you left. You impressed upon me that I bear full responsibility for whatever happened to you, your sudden guest. That's our un unsparing Captain, but what help exactly can you have out here, Professor? To be honest, my dear girl, I do intend to lift the finger. His talent are real deal. He'll pass with fly college, you'll see. Oh, so he feels your friend still lies in fact with me then. Well, I'm sure we'll be fine. Let's begin the trial. Can we go now? Uh, catch me for the first Pokemon species. Can we go now, please? This is Aspiration Hill, the species of Pokemon you're meant to catch all live here. Nice. Let's go. Obsidian Field Lands. Let's go. Time to get ready to catch it. And along comes Bidoof. Let's go. Bidoof. I'm just sharing what I know. Hold down the ZL button to fill them up on a take comes in very evenly your Pokeballs. Target while dodging po wait, hold down Z L to focus on a wild Pokemon. Okay. <gasps> Moody has a middle of this picture, that means that a rough review so that this will be easy. Copy if we don't time to find your next Pokemon. You guys are really gonna hold my hand all the way through this. 
Okay, a starly. This seems fun. Okay, there's one. Do I crouch? Really? Is he gonna tell me how to crouch? That's a starly. They're skittish little things. They'll run. They're startled. Okay. But you should be able to get close to them if you crouch. It will be harder to spot. Okay. Press the B button to crouch and make it harder for avoid them. As you press the same button to rise. If you keep in the tall grass, it will be even harder to catch. Okay, cool. So I got to crouch in the tall grass? Okay. Let's go. Can I sneak up on it if I go this way? Starly, let's go. Bam. That's Starly cut all as well. Only one more Pokemon to go. That's Shinx, right? Was it in the Shinx? Yeah, this is how I'm about to dodge, isn't it? Since you still knew this. Here's a proper way to throw your partner's Pokeball. As Captain Sane tells us, have an item. They're able, but want to send out a Pokemon, press X. Have a Pokemon at the ready, but want to throw an item, press X. Kitson's real expert in these things. Okay. Try throwing a Pokemon ball at, at rocks or trees like this one to have it investigate. If your Pokemon finds a buried or other item, it'll bring them to you. Okay. Now we reach our final hurdle, catching a Shinx. Whoa. Wait, I get XP for that? Awesome. There, that Chinx. Chinx and I guess, could you already tell that? Yeah. I can never tell until I focus on Pokemon carefully. Once aggressive Pokemon get irritated, they'll knock a sliding any ball you throw at them. When you use a DL button, Pokemon, you the more arrows you see pointing at Pokemon, the easier will be to catch. Okay. The next icon will appear above if it has pack, picked the fight with you. Be more Pokemon displaying that it cannot be caught unless you damage them in battle. Okay. I'll teach you to trick to catch aggressive Pokemon. You got to battle them. Once they've absorbed with battling, you can throw a Pokemon at them to try to catch them. But now you've got several Pokemon on your own, don't you? Take one of the Pokeballs and throw it near a wild Pokemon you want to battle. You'll hold it your own in battle. Oh, it's simply three Pokemon that contains one of your Pokemon added. You choose to see what Pokemon you currently have. Man, 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 press every level. You will allow you to toggle between your thrown items and your Pokemon team. Okay. Okay, cool. Wait, how do I... Oh, wait. No. I didn't mean to do that, but okay. That's it, you caught Shinx. Nice. You approach these Pokemon without a hint of fear and caught each one. You're like a gift this guy dropped to us. With the other side, I think the survey corpse has a real chance of compiling a complete Pokedex as we've ordered. This is wonderful. Wonder if you came falling from the sky, you'd like you day, but for now let's tell the professor we're ready to head back. Let's go! Oh, yes, the Pokemon. Oh, I said you'd pass your own flank on the same you went and did just that. Congratulations! You've taken your first step towards seeking out every Pokemon. This calls for a commemorative photograph. With skills like yours, I suppose there's a foregone conclusion. Now then, we best report to Captain Sunny and tell me back to Jubilee Village, eh? 
about to go. In time, we'll be able to send Pokemon you caught to live in the village pastures. Bring up the sick Pokemon you in the field in theory, though we never had anyone skill enough to do so. Come now, you two, let's not dilly die. Captain Cillian awaits a report to headquarters. I bet Captain Cillian will be very pleased. Report to Captain Cillian. Can I buy clothes yet? Yep, this is probably the best book I've ever played in a long time. It feels like a real game, unlike the last one. Sword and Shield is terrible, in my opinion. But this game seems pretty cool. Let's go. Oh yes. It seems you won't you won't have to leave you to die after all. Congratulations, you've passed your trial, you can hold on to that statue. I must admit, you've impressed me. I set a high hurdle to judge whether a stranger like yourself could be worthy, but you cleared it. This is yours, the official uniform of the Survey Corps. Corps. And a pair of Survey Corps sandals. Get chained in the room you used last night, then you'll report at once in the third floor. Present yourself in uniform and for the manner this is your first official order from your captain. And chained into new stuff. Okay. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. This way. Mm, this is cool. I wonder what a dolly would like. Take care of any Pokemon you catch. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Let's go change, I guess. Why couldn't I just change at the... I guess they're trying to show you how the game works, I guess. Makes sense. Do you want to change your outfit? Yes. Time to put on your, and your Survey Corp sandals. Why not? What? Uh, what? Why don't... what? Oh, okay. I was wondering where the heck everything was. Yes. Those are some ugly freaking shoes, though. You change into your Survey Corp uniform. Let's go. <gasps> Let's go. Look how well our server course will suit you. It's almost as if the captain has tailored it just for you. I see you've changed regarding your... You may continue to use the room you slept in last night. You may wear this as well. A hat. Nice. Nice. Now present yourself to the commander. office on the third floor of Galaxy Hall. Where are all these rooms? Well, cool. Awesome. I think this is the biggest game uh, room never made in a Pokemon game. Seriously, I really think this is the biggest building never made in a Pokemon game. Like 3D Pokemon game. been waiting for you. I am Commando, Commander of the Galaxy Expedition Team. Hmm, so you're Crowshock 64. Yes, sir. Hmm. I've been briefed in your station, including how you fell from the rift in the sky. Now let's see what you're made of. Face me in combat. Yeah. 
You got bigger, I'll give you that. You were your stomach to think, but I do see some potential. <laughs> they didn't animate it, why didn't they animate it? Don't expect a warm welcome from everyone. Naturally, some will be so to trust an outsider who literally fell out of the blue. The super suits among us might see you arrive as a por portent of disaster. Blech. But you passed the trial that was put to you. No matter how odd you may seem, you're part of the Jubilife Village. Dedicate your work at the Galaxy of Shame and complete the Pokedex. But I warn you, Pokemon are terrifying creatures give your wits about you as you work. The Galaxy of Petition Team trial has been completed. Well, bam. Let's go. Nice. So the commander has also accepted you. But I understand this begin as a no star recruit among our ranks. In other words, you have no rank at all. Performance was a member of the Survey Corps, you will move up through the ranks indeed. You see, the more you add to the Pokedex, the higher your rank will become. We will also, of course, bring you closer towards your goal of yours to seek out every last Pokemon. Here, well, you will need this. You attain a recipe for crafting Pokeballs. Well, okay, and one Tumble Stone, a Pokemon Tumble Stone. And 3,000 as well, you will have to buy the necessary materials. Whoa. Akari, you're an expert at crafting yourself. Teach your new recruit what he needs to know. Of course, Captain Celion. Now, as experienced crafting here, let me explain a bit to start. Crafting means making items with your own two hands. You can buy some items at the general store, but self-sufficient is worth striving for. Can you make our most valuable tools, Pokeballs. Think where you would be if we couldn't do that. Let's head to the craft works. The basics of crafting. Okay. Let's go. Visit the craft works on how to craft items. Okay. This is pretty cool. Well done earning a place in our team. My name is Anthony. I'm a local clothier. The press asked me that I ready you a change of clothes. Here you, here you go. I do hope they fit. You received an everyday kimono and a pair of everyday trousers. Hope you will avail yourself to village uh, of the village humble shops. Let's go. This way to the craft works, Crochet. Let's go. Wait, these are shops. Awesome. You use a workbench here to craft for anytime you need to make an item in the village. Hmm. And also apply what you need to make your first Pokeballs. Once you're ready to begin, call up my way of saying creators are joining us. Just spend the money you got from the captain and clothes or whatever you think is best. And choose the item to craft, in this case, a Pokeball. Okay, you can use a workbench you have in the base camp to craft Pokeballs and other items. Crafting items require recipe and necessary materials. Okay. Oh, okay. I can ooh, tumble stone and apricorns. Well, I can make, I can make twenty one of these bad boys. I can I make, I can make twenty. Oh, my bad. You made twenty pokeballs. You put them in your satchel. The basics of crafting. Nice. Oh, now that's some fine crushers. Hard to believe. This was your first time stepping up to the workbench, my boy. You'll recall, of course, that Pokemon possess the odd power to shrink themselves down, but the Pokeballs we craft will make use of that power to catch them. All so that more Pokemon species can be duly recorded in a Pokedex. And on that note, here you are. You received a Pokedex. What does it look like? Pokedex, a volume of component collected. Results of much Pokemon research preferred live and hidden continue adds it to it with each report on new Pokemon species. Wow. Task with unreported data six. Okay. Syndical. Wait, what? Wow. Okay. Okay. That's cool. I prepared this volume just for you. I hope it aids you while you're in to seek out all the Pokemon there are in this region. You have to complete lots of research tasks to help the professor fill out the Pokédex. The same goes for me, of course. I've also got Pokemon to research as a survey course member. 
I'd like to call. I'll be happy to explain more about the research tasks I could use your assistance with. Come join me at the field lands camp whenever you're ready, my good Crochek. So I can just go there whenever. Okay. Nice. I can just go there whenever, I guess. He walks weird. I couldn't help but over here. If you're going to the field land camp, would you mind taking care of a request for me? I'm sending guards so I can't leave my post, but I'll be, I'll be here at headquarters if you want to talk about it. People who have something to ask you will request the icon. If you fill their request, you may receive an extra reward. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Hey, so there's this Pokemon called Wormple. Have you heard of it? Well, you see, I have. I was having a chat with Professor Leventon, and he told me that after a Pokemon gains a certain amount of experience, though, battling him like it will sometimes change his appearance and become stronger. He said it's someone called Evolution. Some Pokemon gain Evolution changes their appearance and stats every Pokemon has met. Well, you'll be able to see, yeah. And so I don't want to raise a Wurmple myself and have it evolve. You're part of the survey club, aren't you? If you could catch your Wurmple, could you let me have it? To reward him for your promise, just get me a Wurmple if you can. Nice. Okay, cool. Well, all these people want? You're a newcomer who fell from the sky. You're heading outside the village? Oh, of course you are. It's very close to myself. To get, go out and get you a compile plug book they're working on, right? Well, on your way, Connie, could you find out about Starly? Pokemon are certainly a terrifying creature, but I see a star, I feel slippery hole. Not that I have the least desire to actually touch one, in mind you. Please let me see Starly's entry in the Pokedex when you complete it. Haven't I already done this? Haven't I already... Oh, I haven't cut How do I... Don't I already have a Starly? Oh, okay, I gotta... Makes sense, I guess. We'll just go. I know Shink's ears have odd markings on the inside, but what are they? No use, I can't remember this. It'll keep me up all night. Hey, aren't you with the survey corpse? If you caught it, catch a Shinx, do you show it to me? I gotta see one more on eyes. Please, I can't remember what the ears look like. It's driving me up the wall. Didn't I already catch a Shinx? Uh, yeah. Here you go. It's a Shinx. All right, let's have a peek in those round ears. <laughs> ears of yellow cross brown, kind of like a star. Can't you tell where Lisa's is? Felt like I had a bone stuck in my throat. Only my throat's my brain, and the bone's a thought. Thanks for me get the bone out. What does Shinx ears look like? Well, bam. Potion. He gave me three potions. Okay. Well. On that note, before we actually go and continue, I'm going to end it here because, yeah, it's, and I'm tired of playing games today, so I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Well, actually, let's just uh, talk a little bit about this game for a minute. So far, this game has been amazing. Pretty Pokemon game I've been playing a long time. Love the mechanics. Throwing out Pokemon wherever, it's awesome. I can throw out Pokemon. I can catch Pokemon. It's absolutely amazing. The battling is vamped up a lot. I hope, I hope Gen 9 is like this. I really do. I hope Gen 9 is a full game like this. Absolutely amazing. I think the building... The headquarters is the biggest building ever made in a game, in a Pokemon game, like ever. I really do. It's just amazing. Anyways, guys, guess I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. We'll throw the outro. Hi, right, guys, I'm back. If you made it this far, I want to say a big thank you because watching a lot of my videos like this, if you watch to the end, leave something below, like banana or lemon, or leave, leave your favorite fruit below if you watch this far. Well, it'll be our little secret to anyone who doesn't watch to the end, you won't know what's happening in the comments. One, because comments are good for the algorithm. And two, watch you do my videos and it's good for the algorithm. So if you guys want to do that, it'll be awesome. Also, there's videos here, here, and here. There's two bits on my face, and then there's my channel to click underneath my face to subscribe. That'd be great also. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching my video. I will talk to you guys in the next video. Woo!